Hey guys, Swain here, and today I'm going to do another guide on how to install Joyplay. As there has been a small update, and I just want to make sure everyone has the latest version installed and how to do it properly. Now, if you have any problems, leave them down in the comments. Don't forget to include the error of your issue and what game you're trying to play. So I'll try to help you out as much as I can. Sometimes it could be wrong joy play, corrupt game, or even your phone's not, phone's not powerful enough. But yes, I will not, not know until we actually see the error. Okay, to get first get into this, we need to go to the joy play Patreon. Da da da, we're gonna have to join, can't even what? Completely optional. Because this is just where we get our links, we're to the first post. And we want to download Joyplay 1.20.32. Go onto the Mega, download from there, and the RPG Maker plugin 1.20.14 to the Mega, and download from there. Okay, we've got them two, the main ones we need. Playing visual novels, you want the Remplay plugin. You want to play Flash games, you want the Raffle plugin. Simple. Alrighty, I will also have a Google Drive with the plugins and that available in it if you can't access Mega for some reason. Okay, now we want to load up Joy Play. Oh no, wait, no, not Joy Play. We've got to install them first. Meh. Getting my steps wrong. Storage, downloads, find your APKs. All right, we have a uh, first one. Joy Play 1.20.032, Patron Relief. Click on that. Click Install or Update. Whatever. Let that run through. Then we want the RPG Maker plugin. Click on that one. And that works. Click Update or Install. That run through, okay. We are that that part is done. Now we will light up Joyplay. To add a game. You want to go add, add game, choose. Choose where you've downloaded your games, look all your games. I have mine everywhere. Now let's go tectonic. Go game, choose, name it, version if you want to, picture if you want to, and it will add the game. Up on that, it has a quick check, and it will load in. It may take a little bit to load the first time. I have run like half these games on my phone. Some may or may not have updates or save games. But yes, we are in. And we are playing the game. Okay, close the game, go back. Now, some games will have this pop-up. Requiring the RTP... The RTP for RPG Maker. To get that, we want to go to Downloads. It will take you to the required website. Scroll down, and then... It will list what RPG, what one you want. VX, VX Ace. But most of the time you need the XP one. Click that one, click download. If I actually download it, I already got it. That won't take long. Let download. Go back to Joyplay. Right, get that message back up by click on the game you're doing. Go choose. Downloads. And it will be the XP underscore RTP 104X XE. Choose that. It will run. That will be good. And then you can load that game you are playing. Da -da -da, perk on winter. And we are moving nicely.
It will be sound. I just have my phone down. Okay. Also, if you have map issues, you'll want to long hold the game. Go down to optimize map. It will load up and ask you to hit continue and it will configure the map to make it more compatible with Joyplay. Some games you may not need to do this, but if you have issues, that's always handy. Okay, so that's done, and then that's all good. You can change your settings if you want to, to configure your controllers. I have my gamepad set, oh, I'll go this way, then. set like this. Z, X, C, A, S, Q, on my control pad one. As X, C, and Z. Uh, the main three buttons you'll use during most gameplay. So yes, that is about all there. Now, for your games, I re now for downloading your fan games, I highly rec recommend you get them either from Pokemon Community or Relic Castle, as they're two trusted sites that most developers will upload to. I mean, there are others out there, or you can go to their official discords. Stuff like that. Now to get now the fun bit. You want to open to extract the games after you've downloaded them. Go to Z Archive. And I'll open up my game folder on Magic Book right and most of the time. And then you want to click on the one you want to download and go extract to archive name. That's fine, you can replace everything. It's only a small game, so we can do that. And it will extract everything to the set file. If you go extract here, it will just extract everything here and it'll be a mess. Because some don't include an individual folder. So it's easy just to go to extract there. Let me open up that. This one does. You'll have all your game files. And then just load the XE into a Joyplay and you're good to go. And that about covers it on this tutorial today. I hope it was helpful. Like I said, if you have any problems, leave, leave the uh, game's name and the potential error code below and I can try and help you from there. Well, anyway, I hope it was helpful. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you all on the next one. Bye.